Will timing the business cycle make you more money? Will it protect your portfolio? What is the business cycle anyway? Let's take a look. Let's go through what the technical description of a business cycle is, and hopefully this will shed a little bit more light. So a business cycle technically is described as an aggregate of economic activity occurring across nations. So basically this is an aggregate of expansions and economic activities across the economy, followed by an aggregate in general recessions. These are recurrent, but not periodic. So, what does that mean? Found this chart on the balance. It's a great representation. You can see the expansion followed by the peak there at the top of the mountain, contraction down the other side of the mountain, trough, and then up again. You notice that each peak is consecutively higher. This is what would happen in a healthy economy. Most experts agree that we're in the early part of the economic cycle. So if this is true, you wanna ask yourself, where's the biggest opportunity? And how can you adjust your asset class to benefit yourself. And notice I said adjust. We're not speculating and completely changing our asset allocation. We're making a calculated risk and adjusting it a little bit more heavily weighted one way versus the other. So let's bring up a great chart by the folks at Fidelity. Now you will notice that stocks heavily outperform both bonds and cash in the early to mid part of the economic cycle. So given this knowledge, what do you do about it? Why not try timing the market based on the business cycle? Sounds easy, right? Wrong. History tells us that timing the market very rarely works. This is because we can't predict the future and also because the way that we're feeling emotionally is very often juxtaposed to how we should be investing using logic. An awesome wealth advisor will help you navigate both using expertise and experience. I'm Anna Hilberry. Thank you so much for listening.